We're here in the CTO lab talking IoT. How about that? And uh, this is Jim. And Jim's gonna give us a walk around to some of the tours, give us a couple of demos. I'm, I'm looking around, I'm just seeing all kinds of really great devices. Like that guy right there. There's some, there's some hardware over here. So where should we start? We'll start in our mini lab, let's do it. During our visit to Dell, there was one thing we couldn't share with you just yet. So we're gonna right. save this for three weeks. Future Chris and Noah, save this for three weeks. Dell and the Linux Foundation are launching EdgeX Foundry, an initiative that aims to build a common framework to make IoT usable in the enterprise. The problem we have in IoT is that you have all these different types of devices that speak all these different protocols. Everything from BLE to Modbus and BACnet, which were ancient protocols, at least by most of our standards. They all speak a different format, they speak a different language. How do you bring those all into a single platform? Yeah, exactly. And then make it available to people like you and I to yeah. actually use. That's what our platform called EdgeX Foundry is about. It's a software platform that allows us to bring all that data in, normalize it to a single format, and then make it available to your cloud or your ah. enterprise, as well as be able to control things at what we call the edge, thus the name, EdgeX yeah. Foundry. If you can't control things at the edge, it's too much data and it's too slow for reaction. And we'll talk and show that here in just a second. So you're right, right here we're seeing um, just a, a little visual, a little graphic of the data coming off of, in this case, the gyroscope and this Bosch sensor. Mm -hmm. So you're seeing the ups and downs of that. In fact, we always have fun with those sensors when we take them out the road, we throw them around the room, you get big spikes up and down. <laughs> um, we also get to see who, who drops them and watch it go to the floor. Uh, <laughs> So that's the collection of data, or example of the collection of data by our EdgeX Foundry software into our gateway. That's one job of the system, collect data and make sure. it available. Second job is to be able to offer the ability to do what we call actuation, which means respond to data to you see data. coming in yeah, I was and worried take about some that. action. But it also solves a big problem I never really thought much about. More importantly though, it's not just about gathering data and being able to actuate back down. It's being able to do those in combination, meaning you have to have what we call edge analytics or some smarts, some intelligence on that gateway that's watching all the data come in and being able to translate that back down to actions down to your systems. Say, for example, if we moved that, um, that punch machine here, I'm gonna lower that arm down. Can I get the little mouse on there, right? <laughs> and it's sending off the signal there. Actually, I did it the wrong way. I, I moved it up and it was already up, so let me move it in the other direction here. So there we go. You'll notice the, the sound came out of that pat light. That's a rules engine that's running as part of our EdgeX Foundry that's, in this case, looking for movement on that arm. And so when that's triggered, it sounds the alarm. Sounds the alarm. But you can see it happening for lots of different devices yeah. for lots of Big different industrial stuff. Exactly. You maybe have a proximity sensor that shuts the machine off if your arm gets too close to it. Huh. That's the intelligence you want at the edge. It can be that quick? It can be that quick. Wow. Uh, as you see here, we're not exactly real time yet, but yeah. pretty darn close, right? Enough where you can send off a sensor like sure. that in, in seconds. Um, you don't want to operate your automobile airbag <laughs> with, with our EdgeX Foundry yet, but we're getting close Fair to enough. do Fair that. Uh, that's what local intelligence is all about. That's why you need a gateway. You can't afford to let that data go all the way to the cloud, Right. All the way back down, it's too yeah. late, somebody's lost an arm. It's not just about security and privacy, it's also about timing. timing.